What's going on, guys? This is uh, Aaron with PA Outdoor Junkies, and I'm going to do a review on the uh, Goliath Worm Binder made by Browning. The name says it all. It's huge. It's 14 inches in length, 12 inches wide, and can expand to 5 inches in height. Right now, I have 22 packs of worms in mine. Um, there's still plenty of room for expansion. It comes with seven of the folders, and there's plenty of storage. Okay, let me show it to you here in a sec. Okay, so um, first off, this binder has like a nice nylon poly onto it, so it's pretty waterproof. I don't think your worms will ever get wet in it. it has a cool browning symbol, all my friend and browning stuff. Right off the bat, you have these uh, non-corrosive zippers. Now, they're kind of cheap. They're like a thin plastic, and they're kind of hard to get open and closed. So, I mean, right now, I'm not the biggest fan of them. But, the inside, first off, you have a whole bunch of pockets right there. I'm probably going to turn this into a drop shot worm binder. I'm probably going to put hooks, weights barrels, swivels, whatever else I want for drop shotting in there. Right now all I have is my drop shot worms in here. As you can see, like I said, there's seven pages. I have a whole bunch of worms in here and I have room for expansion. On the back side of this, there's also even more pockets for more storage. Um, it's really nice. They really try to make this so you can store a lot in it. I took it even a step further and labeled my worms by colors just so I can make it a little quick and more organized on the water. Um, I like how they have a piece of, it's like a red cloth in here. I really think it'll, you know, support and make the uh, plastic stronger. These things are relatively pretty easy to open. There's really no struggle to them whatsoever. They close up pretty nice. I mean, all in all, I would give it a 4 out of 5. Like I said, the only thing I really don't like is the zippers. I mean, they're kind of a pain in the butt to zip up here. I can kind of demonstrate it. I mean, as you can see, you kind of really got to put some muscle into it. You really have to, like, kind of make sure you don't get them caught. They're a pain. But I mean, once it is zipped up, it has a uh, really nice carrying handle on it. And there's a spot on it in the back for name card or whatever you'd like to put in it. But I mean, all in all, right now I'm really satisfied with the product. It's uh, I got it on sale for 20 bucks. It costs 25 not on sale. Get it on Bass Pro. Uh, it's like 5 or 6 bucks for 10 extra replacement sheets, what is an awful bad. But I couldn't really tell you on how well this is going to hold up or how durable it is because I just got it for this year. Um, other than that, if you're looking for a huge worm binder, definitely take the Browning Goliath into consideration. Like I said, it is a giant. That's a foot roller there, and I mean, you still got plenty of room. Like I said, thanks for watching. Tune in for more videos.